Hello, this is Hillary Clinton. I want to thank you for letting me speak with you about an issue that is central to our children's future and critical in our fight to restore this nation's economy, solving our nation's health care crisis. The message is simple. It's time to bring about fundamental change, control our nation's soaring health care costs, and provide security for American families again. Let me read you part of a letter from a woman in Warren, Michigan. Dear Mrs. Clinton, I am a middle-class American with a husband and three children. My family ran upon rough times two years ago when my husband lost his job after seven years with the same company. We aren't eligible for state-funded programs and can't afford the price of the insurance premiums so as a result, we do without. I hope and pray that a solution to this problem will come about soon. As we develop our plan, we're thinking about that woman from Michigan and the points of view of every American and every group involved in making health care reform work. The small business person who wants to cover his employees but struggles with premiums that rise at 30% each year. The older American, caught between a fixed income and prescription drug prices that are out of reach. For those people and the groups who have been fighting for health care reform for years, This is not the time for yet another study or report. As the President said in his February address to the Joint Session of Congress, it is time for action. But there's also a lot you won't see in a new system. You won't see the patchwork of forms that frustrate patients and make doctors spend more time with paper than with people. You won't see prescription drugs that cost three times more than they cost in other countries. These kinds of fundamental changes won't be easy. Believe me, I've learned since I started working on this issue, there are powerful special interests who profit from the status quo and high-priced lobbyists who get paid to keep everything the same Anyone who shrugs and claims that change is just too hard has crawled into bed with the billionaires who want to run this country like some private club. They're already lining up to block the change the president will propose. But with your help, we can break the gridlock. People need a health care system that controls costs and provides security to families. And I know the American people share the urgency that I feel, the sense that we must act now. We face a historic opportunity, and we must seize the moment. I ask you to join me and the President in working for fundamental change in America's health care system, 